Today, we're back with a massive sports card mail day with over two tubs full of mail. Try to catch me hollering at the moon. That's not something you see every day, but only at trade night. This is Trevor Lawrence. How are we doing? Oh, this is out of this world. Today is definitely the craziest day ever at a card show. A lot of time ahead and a lot of opportunity to, to, to make this place special every day. So. All right, what's going on YouTube? Card Collector 2 coming at you here with a brand new video. And today we are back for another sports card mail day. And this time we've got a lot of packages to open. It's been a little while since we've done a mail day. It's, uh, it's, it's been quite a while. We were actually in the old office when we filmed the last one. Uh, but I think the wait will be well worth it here as we have two full tubs of, uh, of mail here. So without, uh, without further ado, just going to get right into it and see what we've got in today's Today's mail day, so shout out to those of you joining us for this one. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we've got some cool stuff. All right, well we got this one in here, whatever this is. Oh, so this is actually an air. Um, I actually have to reach out to this seller. Um, he reached out to me. Uh, this is supposed to be a different ticket, which you'll see in a different mail day. Um, I won't give too much of it away, but it is a very cool old school Ohio State ticket I bought. Um, it got sent Dominic Hasek's NHL debut uh, debut instead. Pretty cool ticket. Hasek was a guy I watched as a as a kid. Um, not for me. So this will actually be um, returned to the seller. Pretty cool. But I did buy a ticket, just not that one. So uh, unfortunately, that one will go back and not stay with us. Um, somebody named Trent doesn't look familiar, but we'll see. I know of a few things I'm expecting, so hopefully they're uh, they're in today's mail. Oh yeah, this is cool. I got these for a deal. I'll probably keep one and put the other two out in shop. Um, we'll see. May throw one on the website. We've been adding cards to the website, and obviously we sell on uh, whatnot a few times a week. Um, you know, we have four or five lives a week on, on there for single cards. So. Um, it's hard to tell where these will end up going, but we've got a 7 of 25, which is cool because that's college jersey number, uh, 4 of 25, and then 63 of 99, but three different uh, Ted Ginn RPAs. Uh, one of the most electric guys I ever saw play at Ohio State, and I still think to this day if he does not get hurt in the National Championship, they win the National Championship, but that's a whole other conversation for another day. So unfortunately, the coolest patch is on the out of 99, but that is the true RPA, so that's likely... I'm not sure. I might end up keeping the seven, which is right here, which is jersey number, college jersey number, or the out of 99. The four will likely be made available either in shop, on the website, on an upcoming whatnot stream. All right, so this one looks like it's from DC. So this is an eBay auction. Oh yeah, this is cool. Take this out here. And then another one of these. I don't know how many I'm up to at this point. Uh, but a Sean Wade 101 printing plate wasn't very expensive. If you watch the mail days at this point, you've probably seen Sean Wade in what seems like every mail day, whether it's cracked ice, ticket stubs, <clears throat> or 101s. Uh, when I see them, I try to buy them, especially when they're cheap. I don't like uh, buying the more expensive ones, like uh, you know, overpaying on something that is uh, not worth it. So a lot of the ones I buy are the auctions. And then we got whatever's in here. It's like a lot of something. Not entirely sure. It's. I will say, I like that they're wrapped in bubble wrap, but not like all the way wrapped, wrapped in bubble wrap. I'm sure those of you that have watched uh, our mail days over the years will know that we've spent a good amount of time unwrapping things from bubble wrap. So as long as they're protected, I don't really care a whole lot. All right. So let me see what's in this one. All right, so it looks like a lot of the college stuff. Bowman's best football and Bowman Chrome basketball. Obviously, I enjoy collecting the college stuff, so this one should be fun for me. Hopefully, there's a couple Caitlin Clarks in here. I know her stuff is absolutely on fire right now. All right, I got some autos that didn't make it to uh, sleeves. All right, so let's see what we, or top letters. So let's see what we got here. Uh, oh, I think this is a big lot of like cheap, cheap stuff. I don't think this lot was very expensive. I don't want to like. I think a lot of this stuff was in a was in like value box type stuff. 
uh, Ryan O'Keefe out of 25. But it's, I don't think it's very expensive. This Jack Sawyer, my guy. Shapen out of 50 is decent out of 25. Ty Simpson and AJ Swan. And then I'll show you some of the basketball. But I had to take everything, but it was a pretty good deal, if I remember correctly, for all of it. So autos, I don't know as much. I'll go to my guy Brian. Uh, some Buckeye autos, Bryce Hopkins. Some gold, Georgia. Justin Edwards, Rob Dillingham, Mookie Cook, Kyle Filipowski, uh, Stoyakovich's kid, Brawny Refractor, and Zach Eady. So a lot of stuff. I won't, uh, I won't bore you guys with this stuff. I'll sort through this. Um, again, we've been adding uh, a lot of stuff to the, to the website, especially like the uh, $3 cards, $5 cards, 10s, 12s, 15s, 20s. Uh, so I would imagine a lot of that stuff ends up there. So if you guys uh, haven't checked it out, the link will be down below. It's just cardcollector2.com. Um, but we are, uh, we're going to continue to add some cheaper stuff there as well. And then uh, at some point in time, we'll bring back auctions to our WhatNot channel. I know we haven't done those in a while. Um, but just with the amount of uh, you know value boxes and that kind of stuff we have in shop and as much as we buy, always looking to uh, find different places to add cool stuff. So Anthony Richardson Select Draft Picks Auto wasn't very expensive. I want to say like 50, 60 bucks, but I talk about it in a lot of the lives. Always like uh, holding on to those. All right, I think I know what this one is. I think this is... A really nice card of an old school running back. Hey guys, just a reminder, this Monday we've got a major sale over on our OneNot channel. In addition to a ton of cool stuff we're going to be selling, like singles, discounted retail, merch, and so much more, we've got tons of giveaways from our Prism boxes we just did yesterday. So all of the big hits from yesterday's Prism break, we're going to be giving that away this Monday on our OneNot stream. In addition to that, we've got two boxes worth of Prism Basketball. We're going to auction them pack by pack, starting at $1. And for every 100 orders on our stream on Monday, we'll give away one pack of Prism. We've done some really big streams with thousands of orders. So if we can replicate that here, we'll have plenty of Prism Hobby Packs to give away for free in the chat. Come check it out this Monday over on our WhatNot channel. The link is down below. We'll see you guys there. It is. Very, very cool card. This is too cool not to get. All right. <clears throat> Here it is. Barry Sanders uh, Panini 1 from 2021. Uh, three color, three color patch auto. Uh, one of the best running backs to ever play. Uh, PSA 9. Um, yeah. Panini 1 football is, is awesome. Barry Sanders uh, appears to be on card as well. Just a uh, Cool, solid card. So, fun addition there. All right. Now, I think this looks like an Instagram a lot I bought. I'm trying to remember what was in this, though. Zion. Oh, yeah. Pretty cool multi-sport lot here. All right. So, we got AJ Styles Tiger, uh, Tiger Prism from Select PSA 10. Uh, got a zebra as well. I think there's a few AJ Styles in here. Uh, then you got a Zion Blue 9 at a 249. This card's not worth more than, I don't even know, I would guess 30, 40 bucks. But what was this card at peak at one point? It's, it's kind of crazy to know how much this card's probably changed. Uh, Kurt Angle Gold Auto from Select 10 of 10. Uh, I think this is 2006. So this should be first year. It actually doesn't even say on the back. I think this is 2006 NT, so this should be first year they ever did National Treasures. Multicolor patch, Sean Alexander. How cool is this? MJD. Again, this is back when I got into it, so this is 06. Uh, so MJD, one of the, uh, the better running backs from there. And shout out to everybody who pointed it out in the Throwback Thursday break. I kind of skimmed over Group D, and I didn't even realize it until people pointed out in the comments. But it was like, Ryan, you might want to pay attention to the Group D autos. There's actually some names in there. MJD was one of them. Um, just one of those guys I really enjoyed back in the day. So four color exquisite R RPA, not very expensive. Will definitely stay in the PC uh, as a collector. Maybe, in, I think at some point in my life, I'll try to put some of those exquisite patch auto sets together. I've been working on the 07 one for a while. I need mostly just the bigger names, the, the Peterson, 
I think is the biggest. Um, I actually have Calvin, but just fun sets and not an expensive card, so something I enjoy. Uh, Sparty on, Kirk Cousins, auto 12 of 20 um, from Flawless. And then a uh, Daniel Bryan on-card auto from Transcendent. Transcendent does well. I don't know the name Daniel Bryan as well, so probably not one for me. But um, again, I always talk about it. Wrestling collectors are the most legit, passionate fan base there is in cards, I believe. Uh, so that'll likely uh, end up something we end up moving. All right, next one here. I think this is another Instagram purchase, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, yeah, Tyree Kill, Illusions Auto 5 of 25. Saw something the other day, and it's kind of kind of crazy to think about, but Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs lost Tyree Kill and went out, and Mahomes got a got an MVP in the regular season and two straight Super Bowls and two straight Super Bowl MVPs since losing one of the best receivers in football. Just kind of crazy and speaks to how good Mahomes is. All right, next one here. It says, do not use blades to open. Well, I'm feeling awfully rebellious today, so hopefully this does not bite me. I'll take it easy here if I can, but we're definitely, uh, we're definitely gonna use a blade to open this. All right, perfect. All right, we got a note. Um, gotcha, gotcha. It's a, uh, so I bought some mega boxes, some Donruss mega boxes off of, off of eBay and somebody knew who it was and said, let me know if you hit it downtown. Um, it's kind of cool. Shout out to Scott. I always like it when I buy things from folks and uh, I don't know, you know, I don't buy it necessarily. When I buy stuff online, like it's, it's not always the easiest to tell it's from us. So it's cool when people recognize it and figure it out and send a note. I always appreciate the notes. All right, this looks like a, a just a straight eBay purchase, so I don't know what this could be. It's packaged pretty well. All right, let's see. Oh, yeah, bang. I actually bought this during the Super Bowl. It was either going to be, they're going to win the Super Bowl, and this is the best running back in the league anyways, and this just is finally getting him a ring, or it's the best running back in, this, in the league, and it's a one-on-one -on -one in his Niners uniform. So it was a no-brainer buy to me. I actually think I got a pretty good deal on it. I will say that is one sneaky little tip for any of you that are 10-plus uh, minutes into the Shout-out to those of you still watching. Um, the Super Bowl is one of the best times of the year to buy auctions. Most people are not on eBay. Most people are watching the Super Bowl. Uh, so I have a lot of luck each year, like just browsing eBay during commercials. Um, and this was one of those buys. So nice... Uh, Christian McCaffrey, Phoenix, uh, one of one gold vinyl. Best running back in the league. Um, Niners sell well, so that won't be one I keep. That'll likely be a flip, but definitely a, a cool buy during an opportune time, I think. All right. Um, looks like an eBay purchase. Double, double bubble. All right, here we go. Could be anything. Speaking of the Chiefs, bang. Uh, out of 99, Anthony Richardson RPA. Made an offer on this one, uh, but nice Phoenix RPA, number 32 of 99, Anthony Richardson auto. All right, that's two Anthony Richardsons. Next one here. I think this is another, another Instagram purchase. Almost got out. All right, <clears throat> Anthony Richardson auto uh, from Prestige at a 199. And then a John Riggins notable nicknames auto, 10 of 49. Now this is the third uh, Anthony Richardson auto today. So um, I noticed, again, we're recording this video pretty early, so um, I don't know too much about it now, but I saw there was a post on like Twitter going around that there was an Anthony Richardson auto from Prism that was PSA had declined because they were investigating if it was a real auto. Um, so again, something could come out between now and the time this video goes live. This video is not going to come out live for a week. Today is Friday, February 16th. So the tweet just dropped today. 
Um, so hopefully that was just a one-off scenario, but you can see these ones look relatively alike. I mean, you can see they're, they're relatively small. And then there's this one. So hopefully there's nothing, uh, you know, no concern there, but it's obviously new and I, uh, of course, just saw the tweet and go live with it to record a mail day to get ahead and bought three autos of a guy that just had a fake one pop up. So hopefully it's not fake, hopefully it's not a big deal, but I know if I don't address it, somebody will say in the comments that I ignored it. So want to at least be fair that I did see the tweet, but I don't know what's gonna happen between now and seven days when this video drops. All right, now, oh, wow. So I bought this, I wanna talk about someone we've had a lot of demand for every time we get an auto of her. I bought this in one deal on Instagram. And again, every time we get an auto of her, it sells immediately. So when I saw an opportunity to buy double digit autos of her, I took the chance and I was like, we're gonna buy them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen Livy Dunn autos from Leaf. Somebody posted these on Instagram, so they had 15 of them they were looking to move. It was what they had left. Um, again, every time we've ever bought them, she sells really, really well. They're all numbered to 1127. Might have some early numbers here. 229, 261, 24, 6, 230, 55, 56, 58, 10, 62. So I don't see any like low, low numbers, um, but p possibility to potentially grade some of them. I don't know how well they grade. They got all purple edges, so it would be hard to get clean white corners on them, I would imagine. Um, but again, there's no doubting. She's got a massive online following. She's dating Paul Skeens. She's a heck of a gymnast. Um, and she sells really well. So about 15 of these, won't, uh, won't keep any. Those will likely end up being for sale here relatively soon, but just one of those lots that don't see every day, that is, uh, that's for sure. All right, I don't know what this is. Oh, I know who this is from. This is from Dubs Sports, but I don't remember what this is. He had a story sale, I remember that. I was trying to remember what I bought. Oh, nice, we got a note, got a uh, sticker. Always love a sticker. Uh, keep up the great work, you're doing great things for the hobby, Will. Shout out to Will for the note and the deal. Uh, Steph Curry, 1010. Cool, uh, cool card from Prism Choice of one of the GOATs, probably the best shooter I've ever seen, NBA's ever seen. Justin Hermert, Shimmer Auto at a 25, and then a Justin Fields, Patch Auto Gold Standard at a 49. So nice little three card lot there. Shout out to my guy Will for the easy deal on those. Just can't go wrong buying uh, buying Chef Curry autos. All right, let's see what this one is. I mean, heck of a wrapping. I don't think there's anything else. Heck of a wrapping. All right, another Anthony Richardson auto. Again, this one looks more like the Prestige auto than it does the other ones. I'm sure more is gonna come out between now and the time this video goes live. Um, yeah, I'm intrigued. Again, he's a guy I've been buying a lot of leading up to the National. But I'm definitely intrigued to see what, uh, what comes out of that. Especially considering he's like the best signer in the entire 2023 class because Stroud and Levis and Young don't sign. Oh yes, let's go. Another fun, cheap PC edition, Chris Johnson True Gold uh, PSA 10. I have the 101 Black Finite, so to be able to uh, add this one was just kind of a no brainer and wasn't very expensive. Just love adding cheap, affordable, cool cards to the PC. Gold PSA 10, number to 10 of a guy I loved collecting as a kid, so definitely a fun addition. And then last one here, um, just looks like a, another online purchase. Let's see what we got. I 
I don't think this is right. I buy a lot of stuff online. I don't remember buying a Darrell Revis auto. I'll have to check the tracking. I buy a lot of stuff. I'm like, maybe I bought this. I mean, I like buying Darrell Revis. He's from 07, so you got the Calvin, the Lynch, the Peterson, uh, Brady Quinn, Ted Ginn, Troy Smith, Antonio Pippen. A lot of guys in there I like. I just don't remember buying this one, but never know. I get bored and buy eBay auctions all the time. Um, fun one, but Hall of Famer. I'm not sure. Have to look into that one. Already, I know we started this way, started the video this way, where we got a, a ticket that I know needs to go back. I'm excited to show you guys that one. It's a, it's a one you don't see every day. It's just fun one and mean more to me than most. But, um, but yeah, 15 Livy Dunn autos, multiple Anthony Richardson autos, Chris Johnson gold, a uh, big lot of Bowman Crumb and Bowman's best. Uh, Herbert Auto, McCaffrey 101, literally a little bit of everything today. So definitely a fun, diverse mail day uh, in the new space. Shout out to all of you uh, who made it this far. Appreciate those of you uh, who did. But stay tuned. More cool card content coming soon. But for now, guys, that's all I got. Peace, guys.